good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, whenever and wherever you all. And welcome back to the beta player. I'm playing Vampire the Masquerade on the Tribu Mall. So I wasn't an entire fool. This box most definitely has a role to play, but I did not bring it to the right location. I uh, took me a moment to find out because, but uh, not too too long actually. Remember that workbench where I said there must be something over that workbench. I don't think I've ever seen that there before. Though I must say, I hardly ever went up here. But that made me realize. Well, that's the only other thing I can think of. And then when I did this, voila! All of a sudden, we get an electric action when I hit this box against this fuse thing. And I think that alone will allow us to open the door. I don't know yet. I haven't tried yet, but that is what I'm thinking. At least it's cause for reaction, and I wouldn't want you all to miss out on anything else, now would I? So we are now diving back into it. Hopefully we can show you what it is, but I would not. I hope that the last video was uh, just funny. I'm going to keep that in just to show you a little bit how I fumble around. And by accident, I already saved over it anyway, so yeah. Can't really do a thing about it, but it might be also be fun uh, to see the fill, more or less. Uh, the hell? That is my game bugging out, I think. I don't think is uh... Yeah, normally he has the skin of these coppers over here. Oh yeah, yeah, like you do not. Woo! Uh, point and click. Attack that thing. I'm stuck on rock fighter. Thank you very much. With minions, this fight should be easy. Voila. Well, let's see if they've added anything here, huh? I notice uh, some people go, and this was the boss fight? Yet yeah, that is a boss. You can see how it's being introduced and how, uh, well, it has unique animations, at least for the warrants. It is, a, it is a boss fight, and it's supposedly pretty hard, on, and it is on your own close combat, but, oh, we have minions. We have pink. We have rock biter. This is always a, a very nice, tricky thing to do. Don't haste yourself by doing this. Boom! Uh-huh. That's still at least the same. Let's get down to the next level of the Warns. Ah, I'm looking forward to it. Alright, here we are. And there they are. Very good. Hi. Guys, I really need to get in here. Thank you. Now, this is something that I don't understand about Los Angeles. Perhaps somebody that lives in America can tell me that. But do all your sewers have this type of drop in your systems? Because, yowza, your sewer man needs some heavy, heavy... Well... Uh, are you called high risk pay or something like that? It's, it's like, yo. I mean, I work in a laboratory, or worked, I should say, in a laboratory with high dangerous chemicals, but. Oh, uh, man! This drop is just gruesome. No, I failed! I failed! And I survived somehow! I survived somehow! No! No, I'm quite curious where my minions will be. And if they will follow. Yowza! I thought I would die instantly, but uh, no, you can die instantly thanks to that blade, but I managed to survive. Oh no, they put one on another of those gates around here, and that means that Pink and Rockbiter won't immediately go through. Which means we will be a little bit down on our fighting power. And I already see one of those Tsumichi creations over here. This is where you could uh, normally. Oh, oh wow, he comes through the gate itself? Thank you very much, please do. Come on. 
Or do you have trouble as well with that? Sorry, Pink, but you're in my way. This is, uh, this might be easy. Ow. He says right before he gets hurt. My own mistake. I don't want to go too much forward because, well, you will see. And I also noticed that this is new. So I'm quite keen on looking at it. You. I need some type of code for this. Don't tell me I need to walk all the way back because that means that this mod forces more combat on you. Because voila! That end boss, yeah, there are several of them in this area. But they are as blind as a bat. Normally you can sneak past them. I probably will need black metamorphosis. Yeah, you can sneak past them, they're quite blind, but my minions haven't followed yet. And if I need uh, to use that strong box, well then I'm quite... Oh no, and this dude's gonna explode. Talk about disadvantages. Ah, that can happen. You know, we all have our bad days. Good that he explodes. And your gun doesn't do me much. What does do me a lot is your exploding explode action. Please explode randomly because you have been hurt. Boop, you exploded. Very good. You exploded. Just like a... Lady, I do not want to fight you just yet. Our inventory is full. Darn it, we could use the gun probably to do some more ranged combat, but let's walk up here and hope that our minions can follow. I'm just checking very carefully then. Yes, thank you very much. Oh! A little bit of aggravated damage. And there he is! More enemies! And I think that... Yeah, she's already attacking him. Alright. I wish I had Rock Biter for this fight, but I don't. And there is Rock Biter action. Ow! I sit right in the middle of that, and you move so slow once you are hit by this. I mean, slow motion is cool, but uh, I would rather not have that happening again. Thank you very much. Oh, okay. Do we have anything over here? No, we don't. But we definitely need our means of, uh, well, there are so many exploding explodes. Hello. I wish you would follow. Oh, there's one of the big beasts. And another one of those items! How many do, uh, do we have now? Does that stack? No, it does not stack. It just randomly has allowed us to pick it up. And we do not have to. More or less, we just filled in gaining a benefit. Oh well. We do not make a lot of use of them, so it's, it's not too bad. Oh, hello! Uh, it's attacking, you could... Yes, thank you. And seeing our minions apparently do not care at all and simply have an endless health. And I am quite low, I am going to let them fight it out right now. Because, uh, well, unlike for instance with classical RPGs like Baldur's Gate or Pillars of Eternity, where you really want to take care of your compadres, as death is death, unless you have a resurrection spell perhaps for some of the games, well then, uh, well, you have to take action yourself. Uh, Rock Biter, I initiated combat. Go. go. Go, my boy. Sick him. Come on, come on, you can do it. Ah, don't be shy. He's right over there. Oh, let's think, let's think, handle that, then, huh? 
Well, that's turned on. That's a very cool animation. I wonder what it is uh, going to open up for us. All right, um, think. Yes, that's you. I uh, need to talk to you about. No, an outfit is fine. Open up the backpack. I uh. Wait, do you share your backpack with? With? Uh, Rockbiter? I don't know, but uh, I need to uh, drop some guns. Because I really need to, uh... Well... I simply want to pick up more. Alright then. So when we see such an item, we can use Optinibration for free. We should, uh... Or for free. We can use an optimization skill, and we should probably use that then, with our research skill allowing us to do so. Currently, we are missing out. There are two of you over there! Alright. Well, this is going to be uh, a little simple. Uh, cover your ears, by the way, because this weapon, I think, the last time we used it was extremely loud. And extremely inaccurate. Just explode and explode randomly, please. Hey. Well, explode one and explode two. Thank you very much. Let's mark the next target. If you two would come over here, both of you. Pink. Pink. Cannot talk during combat. Pink. Pink, darling, it's over. It's okay. We're going to get the items later. We're going to kill something else. Because we may need to walk back here. Because this walk. Let me pass. Thank you very much. Yeah, uh, definitely. I think your main character, if you're if you still need to play this boss and you want to have the maximum out of your posse over here, I think it's better if you actually focus your main character on ranged combat. Because look, they block a lot. Why would you not? All right, thank you very much for defeating that enemy. I got stuck on the, the skull thing. That's my mistake. So can we now enter you? No, we cannot. Do we have to backtrack constantly until we can enter that? I don't know. Or open it. No, let's, let's put it better. Open it. All right. Uh, this is going to be a little bit annoying because pink does not allow me to get... Ah, oh, that is very, very annoying. Luckily, they are completely blind and I just escaped. But that was rather annoying. And here's another one. But I need my... Posse to be here. Shroud of Typhoon. Voila. Because it's clearly looking and it was a hundred for a moment. Yeah, I really need my, my uh, companions over here right now. I am built for sneaking and for domination and this game, well, it, this mod really loves you to uh, see all the sights. Let's put it that way. And there's nothing wrong with that. Don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong if I say that. Some people like action RPG a lot better than normal RPG, I'm just a little bit less of the hacking slashy. I have the feeling that we need to go back for the fuse box later, but... First, I really would like to get my minions back. Pink and Rockbiter. So I'm trying to gain as much ground as I can on them. Well, hello. Are you fighting something? Do you need some aid? Yeah, you're fighting that thing. And there's our posse back. In fact, there are two of them. So let's... Oh, there are three of them. And they are not close enough to uh, trigger my minion. I am wanting keen on letting this guy do it. I'm trying to aggro 
rock biter. Ah, oh, there is a rock biter in there. I should say the same, of course, for pink. Then my pink might also go off, huh? Rock biter is active. Rock biter is active. Very good. Just making sure that we don't have anything else. Well, if you're taking rock biter, then I can also turn in the hits. Thank you very much. Goodbye. We wanted that card. Um, is there a reason you're still shooting? Do you not trust us? We just helped you out. Okay, they are attacking rock biter for some reason. Let's stop it. Take a deep breath, everybody. All right. Let's talk to this guy. You're not talking to me. You're just following me. Are you my new compadre? What are you? Uncle Smelly Tooth. Rayen. This tooth belonged to Garrett Ruffin, known as Uncle Smelly, a Nosferatu of powerful blood, embraced in uh, 1899, and the supposed founder of the Shrek Net. Increases the blood obtained from rats, but reduces seduction by one. Uh, I don't use seduction that often. That's fine by me, and we have a new pet! We are now a four-man squad, and one guy is ranged. Might that one bit. One bit, I tell you. Uh, there were some rats over here, and they, uh. Hello? Ah! Very good. Whoa! And apparently, ranged means that he triggers much faster in attacking things. Uh, that does cause us to have less ability to sneak around, I would say. But his range is incredible for attacking. Nope. Do I really have to, uh... Finally, you aggravate, uh, aggro. And I, I just want to clear out the sewers, because I have the feeling I have to backtrack anyways. Hey. Oh, perhaps I don't. I do have the, the necessary keycard. You know what? L let's not, not assume the worst. Let's get... Let's get ahead. Let's get through these warrants. Because if we can do that in this episode, then that would be quite good, actually. To finish the warrants. We've been up there. So now we need to go down here. Oh, hello! Yes, indeed. Why don't you all fight her? In fact, even I am going to join into the fray. Ow! Oh, that was a little painful, but not too bad. Oh, that is... Well, a prostitute made into a Tsumitsu play toy. One bullet. And wait for the random explosion. Or you to aggro and kill her. Find out a way. Wait. Sesame, open D. Oh, well, you are status clear. Uh, are you a minion or not? I'm still not entirely sure. He hasn't said anything yet. Oh. Sorry. Yeah, yeah. You can attack. You can attack. I was in the way. I'm sorry. Rock biter. You know how we can usually test that if he's a minion or not? If we uh, will call upon them and ask to gather all minions. Followers, whatever you have you. Ow, I'm standing too close. I'm, I either should attack and do something or I should just stand over here because they explode. And that is just... Uh-oh. Pink. Let's test the theory that they get up after fighting. We also don't have the other guy, so we definitely could use a little bit of aid. Holy heck! That's not good. I think still the powers are still active though. So I'm going to say that she will get up again. And we're going to let Rockbiter fight for a moment, because Rockbiter is a gargoyle and they should be able to take an extreme amount of punishment. 
Nope. He also fell down. Then where is the other dude? Dude, will you come with us? Do you know how to navigate a freaking gate? Uh, do everything myself here. Well, Rockbiter is standing up again. As a thing. Yeah, they just get up whatever happens after a fight. That is awesome. And I should have never have needed to have loaded with the Ultra fight, but uh, Ultra Hunter fight, but whatever. Uh, I want to fight with you guys. Voila! That's how you do it. Let's take this gun. Model scenery structure. Panel new. Uh, shall we call this a glitch? I will call this a glitch. And I can't use it. Oh wait, I can. A difficulty of 8. We can open a difficulty of 8. No problem. But uh, we clearly see a, a little bit of a, a, a glitch here. But, uh, well, it is not too, too bad of a glitch. Huh? Voila, we opened it. Um, I now do not know if I have or if I haven't activated it. That is still closed. Let's do that again, because I may have activated this twice. Uh, perhaps there's also one on the other side. I also know that this is here still here. Hello? This is locked. Perhaps this is a free uh, way puzzle. Let's go back in here. I don't know, once again, if I did this correctly. Let's do that again. Did that activate this? No. Did it allow me to activate this? Nope. Please don't tell me I have to walk all the way back to the very beginning where there was a panel and I couldn't use it. You know what, if that is the case, I'm going to make a little cut in this video, walk all the way back, see if I need to go there and then come back to you. Because otherwise you're going to see me so much running around these warrens that it's just not fun to just watch my ass work out my undead ass. Get you, you little rat, for a little bite. But, uh, yes, I'll be back in a flash. And we're back. And, uh, well, it was correct. When I moved all the way back, backtracked, I could flip now the other switch. So I hope that that has uh, done what I asked. And that it will, this switch will be active. Yes, it is. Voila. And that should probably activate this switch. Which is a little bit silly that you have that switch and that switch. But, all right. Well, with that, we have finished the Warrens, and that is, uh, I know that this video is running a little longish, longish, not too, too, too long, but, uh, yeah, ending the Warrens, I thought, would be a good end for the video, so let's get inside of here, um, you know, I did press button, by my knowledge, ah, I pressed it twice, And this is where we need to go into, in order to find an Osferatu and look! All kinds of monitors tracking movement. Uh, hey, rat, get over here. No, you know what, that one blood drop is not worth eating a rat for. This big drop, it's the drop we need to take. And then we have finally, or finally, that didn't take too, too long, but then we have finished the Warrens in our search for the Nosferatu and then in the next episode well it's going to be all about talking to these Nosferatu and I assume receiving their gracious grace for helping them out and I was walking probably one again on one of my minions and moreover I noticed that uh, the other guy is not a minion we cannot talk to him we cannot Mark Bader, where did you go you just dropped into the ground uh, but yeah, we cannot talk to him, we cannot make him appear to us, so unfortunately... Well, it's just Rockbiter and Vivi. Nonetheless, yeah, I knew this was here. Oh, it's just money nowadays. Okay, no problem. I thank you for watching. And, uh... Well, here's a nice spot to show that off. Show them both off. No, Rockbiter, you need to be in the light as well. Not... Vivi cannot steal all the light, Rockbiter. Come on, be a man. Show yourself. Very good. Stand still. 
good. Good. You're nice and frame. Very, very good. Well, I hope you enjoyed this uh, little longer episode. And the next time, it's not going to be about combat, it's, but it's going to be about talking to these Nosferatu. I say I thank you for watching, and remember, great peril yields great beauty.